So I'm about to show you here the electric charcoal starter. I got it here from Walmart. Basically, it works for getting your charcoal ready in just minutes. As you can see by the picture, you put it in this container here, which is the charcoal chimney, and go ahead and get your charcoal on fire. Here's all the instructions basically back here. Um, you put uh, the charcoal uh, in the chimney. Um, you plug this in, and then, which I have it right here, you plug that in, and here we go. So I went ahead and put the charcoal into the tower. Make sure you have this hooked over the back side as well. You got your handle here because it will get really hot. You can see it's white from getting hot before. And then you leave it in here about eight minutes. And you go ahead and disconnect the, the uh, disconnect the starter from the power source and let it sit there and cool off. And then pull that out and you uh, <clears throat> remove it from the chimney is what you do. And then wait just a few more minutes and put it into the, uh, the grill. And in about 20 minutes total, it is already ready to go. So I like doing it this way because you don't have to worry about using any lighter fluid, kind of waiting on that. It's just in that tower. So I'm gonna show you what that looks like here in just a few minutes once that catches up. And then you're basically ready to get your food on the grill. It's an amazing invention. I don't know why anybody ever didn't think of it before. You could probably use it to start a fire in your fireplace or at your campsite if you can get a really long extension cable. Mm -hmm. This is, this is just about mm, two to three minutes after I, I have uh, set it right here and left it alone. Like I said, it's plugged into the power source, and there you go. I have this awesome friendly bee just, just keeps standing here watching me like he thinks he's going to get steak. Not happening, buddy. But there it is. That's just two to three minutes. So I will be removing the electric charcoal starter after about five more minutes. All right, so it has been about the total of eight minutes. As you can see, it's gotten... Very hot. I don't want to get much closer as it is uh, in the picture here. It does get orange, just like it shows here as as, um, as it does in the picture. The charcoal starter actually gets that hot. So I'm gonna go ahead and unplug it. There you go. Roll tide. And there you go. So it's gonna sit here for another few minutes before I remove the charcoal starter from the charcoal chimney, and then I will pour the amazing white hot charcoal onto my grill. All right, here we go. As you can see, they are turning white hot and ready to be poured. Dun, 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 dun. Going to the grill, going to the grill. Oh. And within just a few more minutes. Oh, yeah, can you hear that? Oh, snap, crackle, pop. It's Rice Krispie on fire. So thanks for watching the Showstopper Shows. My name is The Showstopper. As you can see, I'm about to grill this food. I have some steak, I have some burgers. About to have some fun out uh, here. So um, check out the charcoal starter. I recommend it. It is awesome. Give it 100, a rating of 100. It's not even close. It's so good. I love it. It saves time and I can just chill. Keep out of reach of children. I'm sure you already knew that with your 38 year old grandson. Hmm, he should be able to do it though. He'll be okay. Um, so anyway, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to this channel. Please like all my other videos as well. Let me know what you think. And I'd like to hear more from you as well. May the forks be with you. May his presence be with you always. The show stops here.